It's super important to provide tips for your girls on your big day, just so that they feel confident and ready to go into the day, they don't have to worry about their makeup, and they look photo ready. So today we're gonna to show you a few simple makeup tips that are easy to follow for your bridesmaids. The first tip is going to be using shadow as your liner. This is really great because it gives you definition without being too defined. So I'm gonna be using a brown and a black shadow, mixing them on a small brush. And it's always important to start with your eyes. That way, if there's any fallout, you can clean it up really easily without ruining your face makeup. When I'm applying this, I use short strokes as opposed to a long stroke. This will help get more precise. For bridal party makeup, it's important to keep it fresh. Today, I'm gonna to show you where to put your highlighter in order to keep that glowy look. One of the most important things to remember is if you're more fair skinned, use a champagne highlighter as opposed to a gold. If you're more tan, you'll use a gold highlighter. I'm going to place this underneath her brow on the tops of her cheeks. Be sure not to bring it too close because that will emphasize texture. On the tip of her nose and right above her cupid's bow. These are where your skin is at its highest points and this is where your face would naturally be highlighted. For an extra pop, I'm going to place highlighter on the inner corner of her eyes. When choosing a brush for highlighting, it's important to keep it a smaller, fluffier brush. I don't recommend using a fan brush just because it's too precise and will cause a harsh line. For the final tip, I'm gonna be showing you how to create a bold lip. This is gonna help elevate your look from every day. First, I'm gonna be placing down a lip conditioner or just a chapstick will work. This is going to help your lip liner glide on much easier so you get a smoother line without it being too patchy. Next, I'm going to be going in with the lip liner, and this is going to be the same color or very similar to her lip color. This is going to help with longevity. Once your lipstick wears off, the liner will be underneath. For lip color, I tend to go more towards a semi-matte lipstick. This helps it keep it looking natural without over drying your lips. With these tips, your bridesmaids will feel confident and beautiful in creating their own makeup looks for your wedding day.